Hi guys, this is Rara Ra Coco. Quick update with our ticker symbol, beloved ticker symbol, BBIG. If you would like to know what is going on right now with BBIG and why we were pinned down below $1, then this is a video for you. If you would like to know why over a year and a half now that the short sellers, the market makers, and the hedge funds have not returned 35 million shares. One year and a half already, they have not returned 35 million shares. If you would like to know why the short sellers right now keep keeping a share on loan above 50 million shares, then this is a video for you. If you would like to know how we will win and how the price of BBIG will go up above $1, then this is a video for you. Hi guys, so this information right here is uh, what you call uh, the live short interest for ticker symbol BBIG. As you notice, this one right here, this is the live short interest, and it's now 36 uh, million shares. 36 million shares, it's actually being like in, in the 35 to 35, around that area, 35 to 36, around that area, since one year and a half ago, and they have um, not returned their shares. Now, on this regards, there's also a daily transaction that is happening on BBIG. So this is what happened Friday. So Friday, they borrowed 1.92 million shares, okay? On Friday, 192 million shares. And uh, they only returned 641. So total borrowed release, 1.28 million shares, okay? Now they used that that day on a Friday. They used that to, to dilute the stock and to reduce the price of BBIG uh, below $1. So they controlling the price again and again on a daily basis every time we on a daily basis since we've been invested so they were successful from twelve dollars they were successful to bring it down to one dollar what the short sellers the market makers and the hedge fund what they want is for you the retail investors on bbig to get upset to get frustrated it's because they keep bringing the price down. Now, this has been happening for more than over a year, okay, to two years, right? Um, and a lot of us, a lot of the investors that was invested on $11, $12, $10, $7, they sold, right? They, they, they gave up. They gave up on BBIG. And as you notice, they become shill and FUD for BBIG. And they become very, very upset of BBIG because they lost a lot of money on BBIG. Now, all of us who have not sold and are holding our ground, we are the one who kept the price of this BBIG to reach the bottom, which is like uh, 65 cents to 75 cents. Because we did not sell, we keep holding. That is now our bottom price, 65 cents to 75 cents. We keep holding, we did not sell. Now that we reaches that bottom, as you notice, Every time right now there is a news or something, people are buying and the price of BBIG goes up. Now, there are so many things they are manipulating and abusing the stock. First is to reduce the price of BBIG below $1. All of our orders, okay, that happens, especially on Friday, this is what they do. Instead of them bringing the price or, or forwarding our order directly to the NASDAQ or NYSE, they are actually routing our order to the dark pool, okay? And, and this is uh, the proof on that one. They are routing our order in the dark pool. And the orders that they routed is this short volume exchange. They routed Friday about 1.6 million shares to the dark pool. That prevents the uptick price of BBIG. So now, now you know why they do that daily, okay? Um, they also um, 
instead of delivering our orders directly to NASDAQ or directly to us, they will do fails to deliver, which is if we buy today, they're supposed to deliver it within two days. But what they do is they wait for T30 days and T35 or 45 days. They will not deliver our orders, okay? They will delay it. And that is called fails to deliver. They purposely use that advantage to them, not deliver the stock, to bring the price down and pin down the price of BBIG below $1. Now, I know they're going to do this. I know the short sellers, the market maker are going to do this. And that's why I did not sell my massive amount of shares of BBIG. As you know, I'm accumulator of BBIG. I'm long, 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 and I'm in a long-term relationship with BBIG. The same thing with MULN. But let's talk about BBIG. Okay, what is going to make this price go up? All right, the more of us buy, hold, and repeat, the base price of BBIG will go up. And it's happening right now. So right now, it's coiling. BBIG is coiling. It's because we keep buying at a lower price right now. This is the cheapest, cheapest, cheapest price you can get of BBIG. As you notice, every time it goes to 65 to 72, 72 cents, it goes up over $1. It spikes up, right? Because people will buy, all right? And hold. Buy, hold, buy, hold, buy, hold. And it keeps doing that. Now, they manipulate the stock on a daily basis, okay? The market makers, the hedge funds, and the short sellers. And that is natural. Let me prove it to you how they are manipulating it. It's because they are, they are invested, invested in this stock in a put position. They are betting that the price of BBIG will go down drastically low into bankruptcy. And they don't have to pay whatever they borrowed. But they are wrong. It's because Adriser, Lomotiv, and uh, BBIG, this triple threat, okay, these three things that is going on with BBIG is, is strong and has a very good foundation. It's just manipulated, infiltrated, okay, ridiculed, abused, and this is like a movie. They really, really abused BBIG. They really, really hammered down BBIG. It's because there are big company elite out there. I mean, I'm not mentioning anything. I mean, what about this other, you know which company this is, right? You know what I'm talking about. I'm not going to mention that name. But you know what I'm talking about? The market makers for BBIG. You know what 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 the... What, uh, who's that, right? I think it starts with letter S. That company, letter S, all right, is somehow, somehow controlling the price action of uh, BBIG, singing, sending it to the dark pool, doing fails to deliver, purposely manipulating. Why? It's because they are invested on our competition, right? They are heavily, heavily invested on our competition, TikTok, right? Uh, I'm not a financial advisor. This is just my own opinion. Um, what I'm saying right now is just my own opinion. This is not financial advice. So this information that is that is very, very crucial to understand. So if you don't know the entire big picture of BBIG, of course, you don't have a conviction. You're going to sell. But guess what? There are massive, massive supporters of BBIG. Mr. Rick is one of them. Uh, Lorne Ross is one of them. There are massive, massive uh, supports. Uh, Aaron is one of them of BBIG, okay? They got new team, new leaders, new managers that's coming out. Um, I've been waiting for so long for this to happen. I know there's going to be a big change. And I know we are in a bearish market. And I know this thing is going to change around. The first thing that's gonna things that's gonna change around are the penny stock or the one that is being abused. It's because they have to return the shares that they borrowed for the longest time. They're gonna have to release it no matter what. And and when that happens, of course, the price of BBIG will skyrocket and will go up. It's just because they shorted it to the oblivion, right? They abuse BBIG to the oblivion, right? So I just want you to know that on a daily basis, they do this. They borrow on a daily basis, short BBIG on a daily basis to pin it down below $1, to pin it down, to frustrate for all of us 
who are holding these shares, they want our shares. They don't have shares right now to really distribute. It's all owned by retail investors, which is us, the BBIG family, strong together, all right? So with this information right here, take a look at this um, short sellers, okay? This one is Sashkahana. All right. Sashkahana has 1.5 million shares right now. This is just on put. Okay. This is just on put. They're, they own 1.5 million shares, betting that BBIG price will go down further down than uh 90 cents okay they are they are they are uh wishing that bbig will go bankrupt so that well you know they have tiktok right now you have simplex trading to two, 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 227 shares okay via books sj america 450 parallax 7800 jane street 481 HAP 507214 689 Citadel have 689 right so and then here's Barclay Barclay has 1.4 all right 1.5 million share uh Bank of Montreal 142 so these are the company that are betting that BBIG will go below 10 cents Okay. Again, this company are betting that this the BBIG will go below ten cents. I don't believe that that's going to happen. It's because we have now reached uh, sixty-five to seventy-five was a very very solid uh, bottom price of BBIG. It was tested so many times. It goes up every time they bring it. There, it goes up every time it goes there. It just goes up and then shoots up over one dollar and then they try to bring it down. Now the tactics is to Let's make the retail investors lose interest so that we can buy their shares and then we can distribute that somewhere and dilute some and, and, and distribute that somewhere and then bring the price down of BBIG. They're not, we're not gonna let them do that. We are not going to let them uh, do that. Okay. I will not allow that. I will keep my shares and I will keep doing that. The utilization right now is 95.61%. It's almost 100%. So this utilization, what that means is one, almost 96%, almost 95% of the shares out there for one broker, it has already been utilized and used. So meaning how many, how many left, right? How many shares left they can have to short the stock? Well, there, uh, this is just the one for one broker, right? There is more, but it has, I think what I've seen is there is 400,000 shares. Okay, I think there is 400,000 shares. Let me just show you, which is this one. There will, uh, is it this one? Oh, here it is. It's this one. Okay, so shares available. There is still 400,000 that they can borrow from Monday to use to short, uh, to short BBIG. Okay, so that's what that is. Now, cost to borrow right now is 14.91, which is 15%. If they attempt to close whatever the shorted position that they borrowed and they have not returned, it will take three days. That's what this one means. It will take three days to return them, all right? Shares on loan right now is 53.02 million, okay? The shares that they have right now is 53.02. 02 million. If you convert that in percentage, that is a massive 26.43%. All right. And then estimated short interest for free float right now is 17.61%. That is massive. Now, the only reason why this is down, it's because remember, um, this should have been at 26 to 30%. It's because before the free float of um BBIG was at 170 million and now it's 200 million. It went up 30 million because of the warrant exercises, right? But doesn't matter on that one. Short interest estimated estimated value right now is total in dollars is 
15 million, 32.15 uh, million. Guys, if you like this kind of update with regards to ticker symbol BBIG, uh, please subscribe, please hit the like button, please hit the notification button. My name is Ra Ra Coco. May you have love, peace, prosperity, and good health be with you all. Thank you very much, and you have a great day.